Hello, I want to show you how to schedule multiple rounds of interviews with candidates in Greenhouse using Chronify. This latest update makes it easy for you to have candidates just with one booking link schedule themselves into several interviews at once. And you don't need to ask for their availability or check with the interviewers what times or dates work for them. Now to do this, you go to the candidate's profile and then you move the stage, uh, we go to the face-to-face -face stage. What I want to do is um, send invite link, an invite link for the candidate to book themselves into these four interviews. To do that, I open up the Chronify extension and then create a new multi-event. The candidate's details have already been pre-filled here. And then next I need to name the booking page title, which gives the candidate some context about what to expect. And now I want to, based on my selection criteria, I want to customize each of the events. So this is the first event. And what I want to do is for the cultural interview, I want one, I want two people from the hiring manager pool. And then I also want two people from the support team um, pool. I then first off, um, add hiring manager um, and then I can also add um, support team leads. So basically I know the people on the support team. Um, I just need to add two more people from, from the support team. Now the title of this page um, is the title of that particular event is the cultural interview. Um, so that the candidates know what the what this um, is. I'm fine with the default conferencing and the duration. I click on next. Now for this second interview, which is the peer panel, I want three people. So I'm just going to pick um, any two from customer support and then um, associates. So I am going to change the host here and, and then look for customer support leads and also pick one of the associates. So say, for example, I want to have one of the associates join. I select that. Um, I need to label this as well, the peer panel. And I'm also fine with the duration. And then I add the next event. For this next event, I just need two people. It's a case study event and I want um, to select from the back end developer pool and also hiring manager. Um, so here I select back end developer um, <clears throat> and then um, the hiring manager as well. Hiring manager here is Andrew and then I label this as well, which is a case study. And then next is I add the last event, um, which is the leadership pool, which is the executive interview, um, label that, and then add the VP of sales and VP of marketing. Now, once I do this, um, as you can see, I can see all the different events here. If I want to add one more event, I can do that, but I'm fine with the four events. Um, it also shows me all the people um, where I am selecting the interviewers from. Um, and then what I can do is limit uh, the number of days that I want all the, the interviews to happen in. So if I want all the interviews to happen over the next two weeks, um, the candidate is only able to select um, time slots within the next two weeks. Now, once I'm done with that, I just need to go ahead and create the event, copy the details, um, and then send an email to the candidates. So this is what the candidates will see when they click on the link after you send them the invites. They can change their time zone to a time zone that works for them. Um, they can see all the different interviews that they'll be scheduling themselves into. So let's go ahead to do that. Um, this is the first event. You pick the second event. Um, you pick the third event as well. And then you pick the final event here. 
Um, now the, the candidates can see all the time slots that they've selected. They just need to confirm this and done. All the four interviews have been booked. You come back here, you will see that all the interviews have been scheduled for um, in your face-to-face -face stage in Greenhouse.